Welcome to our comparison video. Today, we are delving into the world of ovarian cysts and exploring the comparison between CT scans and ultrasounds for their detection and diagnosis. Ovarian cysts are fluid-filled sacs that can develop within or on the surface of the ovaries. In this video, we'll take a closer look at the benefits, considerations, and differences between CT scans and ultrasounds in detecting and diagnosing ovarian cysts. Now, let's get started. CT scans or computer tomography scans utilize X-rays and advanced computer algorithms to create detailed cross-sectional images of the body. Let's explore some key aspects of using CT scans for ovarian cysts. Imaging Precision CT scans provide high-resolution images offering detailed information about the size, location, and characteristics of ovarian cysts. The cross-sectional images allow healthcare professionals to evaluate the cyst relationship with surrounding structures. Enhanced Visualization CT scans can capture images of cysts in patients with a higher body mass index or those with complex pelvic anatomy where ultrasound images may be limited. Additionally, CT scans can detect other abnormalities or complications related to ovarian cysts. Radiation Exposure it's important to note that CT scans involve exposure to ionizing radiation. While the amount of radiation is considered safe, it's crucial to consider the potential risks and benefits, especially for women of reproductive age or those requiring multiple imaging studies. Ultrasounds, also known as sonography, use sound waves to create images of the body's internal structures. Let's examine some key aspects of using ultrasounds for ovarian cysts. Non-invasive and radiation-free Ultrasounds are non-invasive and do not involve radiation, making them safe and suitable for repeated imaging. This is particularly important for monitoring the progression and changes in ovarian cysts over time. Real-time imaging Ultrasounds provide real-time imaging, allowing healthcare professionals to visualize the cysts as they move and assess blood flow patterns. This can aid in distinguishing between different types of cysts, such as functional cysts or more concerning masses. Limited visualization in certain cases Ultrasounds may have limitations in visualizing cysts in patients with obesity, gas in the bowel, or when the cyst is located deep within the pelvis. In such cases, CT scans or other imaging modalities may be necessary for a comprehensive evaluation. Now that we have explored the benefits and considerations of CT scans and ultrasounds for ovarian cysts, let's discuss some factors that should be considered when choosing the appropriate imaging modality. Clinical Presentation The clinical presentation, such as the severity of symptoms or suspicion of complications, plays a role in determining the initial imaging choice. In some cases, both CT scans and ultrasounds may be used in conjunction to provide a comprehensive evaluation. Patient factors Patient-specific factors such as age, medical history, and body habitus should be considered when selecting the imaging modality. For example, ultrasounds are often preferred for pregnant women or those with known allergies to contrast agents used in CT scans. Availability and expertise the availability of imaging modalities and the expertise of healthcare professionals in interpreting the images should also be taken into account. Access to specialized ultrasound equipment or expertise in interpreting CT scans can influence the choice of imaging. Both CT scans and ultrasounds play important roles in the detection and diagnosis of ovarian cysts. CT scans offer detailed imaging and enhanced visualization particularly in cases where ultrasound may be limited due to patient factors or complex pelvic anatomy. Ultrasounds, on the other hand, provide real-time imaging, are non-invasive and do not involve radiation exposure, making them suitable for repeated imaging and monitoring of ovarian cysts. That's all for today's episode. We hope you found this discussion on CT scan versus ultrasounds for ovarian cysts informative. If you have any questions or topics you'd like us to cover in future episodes, please let us know. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.